Hello doll family. Welcome back to Little Honey Buzz Doll Nursery. As you can recall, I invited you guys to follow me on my journey on my uh, first kit that I had planned to do that will actually be for sale. This is the Britney Asleep Kit from Bountiful Baby. And I haven't had a chance to start her. I wanted to start her on Monday. But I needed some pallets that I ordered from Amazon and they never came. They just came today. Today's Thursday. It was due yesterday. So I planned to start yesterday, you know, because Tuesday I was babysitting and tomorrow I'm supposed to babysit today, but now it's tomorrow. So I wanted to get started, but I want to let you guys know that um, I'm here and I'm getting started. I'm about to do my first base coat and I'm using my new Ultimate Fusion Paints. And I'm just going to... I need some water. I'm going to use my distilled water. If the camera cuts off, I'll just edit that out. <laughs> and I'm going to need start oh my goodness <laughs> I can't get it open but I don't want to squeeze it too much because I don't want it to come out there it is I need one drop I guess that's a drop <laughs> oh you know what I need to sh shake this up Yeah, that's about a drop. Of, um, that's the flesh tone. A flesh base. And a vein, a drop, one drop of vein blue. And one drop of primary blue. It's not in the same well. And I see the measurements here on the little tuber, tube thingy. <laughs> I'm going to need to bring it up four milliliters, 40 milliliters. Each one of these little lines is equal to 10. So I'm going to bring it up. I want to go. I got to bring it up. Cause it's not loading where I need to load, but it's going. I don't know if you guys saw that. <laughs> and then I need to mix this I think that's a little better and I need just a drop of the vein blue I don't know if you can see the color mixing here and I want it to be transparent of course just giving you guys an idea of what I do 
when I'm painting a kit. This just doesn't look like enough. And of course I want it to be as transparent as possible. Yep, we're up to five minutes so far. <laughs> and then I'm gonna need two drops of the blend flow. That'll help to keep the to help the paint stick to the vinyl. And you know, this is a little, you know, a pain in the butt kind of painting to me. I'm so used to working with my my own uh, my regular golden or liquitex air dry paints for just acrylic paints. But you now you can do all this special uh, measuring and all that stuff, and I can't even see where this is. Okay, one, two. I guess that's right. <laughs> And we know that this blue stains very easily. It's nice and transparent. Okay. I always start with the head because I learned over time that when I do the limbs first, and by the time I get to the head, my paint's just about gone. But if I start with the head first and then uh, do the, uh, the limbs, it usually comes out okay. I usually have plenty left. I don't, you know, feel like I'm running out. Okay, so there we have it. I'm going to stop here because I don't know how much time I have on my phone. But I wanted you guys to uh, join me on my journey and just let you know that I've gotten started. So, <laughs> I'm going to let you go now. If you're new to my channel, thank you for stopping by. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe and share. And follow me on my journey. By the time I get this done... Oh my goodness, she's going to be gorgeous. <laughs> Take care, guys. Bye-bye. Thank you so much for joining me.